Hi everyone, Stiffy from GRM here again. For our next episode, we're talking about the S5000 engine. So the engine starts life as a Ford Motorsport 5.2 litre Cody Illuminator engine. Uh, comes in a crate from, from the States. From there, Roger Higgins at Innovate Engines in Queensland does a lot of the work in terms of design and manufacture of the structural rocker covers. The actual engine is structural in the car. Conversion to dry sump, again structural sump, inlet manifold and drive-by wire system and engine harness for wiring. The basic specs on the engine produces 560 horsepower. We've got a variable valve timing on both the inlet and exhaust, which gives us unbelievable control over the characteristics of the engine over the whole rev range. So it's really quite flexible. Uh, although it's a crate engine from the States, a lot of this is Australian design, as I said, GRM designed and fabricated full stainless steel uh, headers and secondary uh, exhaust system carbon fibre airbox assembly and also a GRM specified and fabricated cooling system. So with the design brief of the, the S5000 to really capture the essence of the old Formula 5000s of the past, the engine's obviously a massive part of that. So we needed to, to make sure it had the right amount of power, the right sound, flames coming out the exhaust, and again, really get the fans on the fence wanting to watch these things race. In addition to that, we've got to make sure it's obviously safe and it's going to be reliable and cheap to run. So obviously having an off-the-shelf crate motor makes the parts readily available and keeps those servicing costs down. So overall with this engine choice, for the teams, we've got a, a reliable, readily serviceable engine. For the drivers, something really powerful and responsive to drive. And for the fans, the right noise and excitement for the racing. <laughs>